February 6. So, and it shall come to pass that before they call, I will answer, and while they are yet speaking, I will hear. Isaiah chapter 65 verse 24, King James Version. There is an international program called Days for Girls, which provides feminine hygiene supplies to young girls. I have been involved with the project for a couple of years now. My supplies have gone primarily to the girls in refugee camps in Africa. Most every girl and woman everywhere has something in common, a monthly menstrual cycle. Many countries are blessed with adequate means to deal with this area of female life. However, there are places where normal activities almost come to a standstill during the few days of menstruation. When hygiene supplies are made available, it is life-changing for young girls who can continue to go to school all month long instead of missing several days. Days for Girls volunteers supply needed items along with a washcloth and a small bar of soap. I have asked motel proprietors if they could consider either donating or selling me a few bars of soap for this special project. A friend of mine and her husband recently took a trip to a distant city. Jenny, being interested in my project, asked the motel clerk where they stayed if she could buy 10 to 12 small bars of soap. The clerk responded, how would you like a whole case? Jenny exclaimed, a whole case? Then the clerk explained that the motel had recently changed brands and they didn't need the case of soap they had been using. Jenny took the case of soap to her motel room and tried to figure out how to get it home. She removed clothes from her suitcase, placed them in a carry-on bag, and crammed both suitcases full of soap. When they arrived at the airport, the airline check-in clerk asked why Jenny's suitcase was so heavy. With green, her husband responded, Soap. The clerk exclaimed, Soap? And they laughed. Then, Jenny briefly explained that the soap was for a missionary project. The lady said that she too had done some missionary work in the past and gladly waived the $40 excess baggage fee. Back home, I was very surprised when Jenny presented me over a thousand small bars of soap, all of which will bless many girls in distant lands. God definitely helped with my project, answering before I even asked. What a mighty God we serve. Mary Beth Giselle